The word for today is gift. I'm really bad at giving gifts. I can never think of that exact perfect thing, you know? The one thing that's just going to bring surprise and delight and how did you know to a person's face, I just can't come up with it. Every once in a great while, inspiration strikes, but to me that just serves to emphasize what an inadequate gift giver I am all the other times. Many times I end up deciding to not even really try that hard. I think one of the reasons that we worry about giving gifts or how good the gifts are is because we feel a sense of obligation whenever we receive a gift. I have friends and family members that are so good at giving gifts. I can't count how many times I have received the perfect thing and thought, this person knows me so well and felt all the things that I want to make other people feel. And then when I can't, I feel guilty. I'm not living up to my obligation. I'm not paying back the gift I've been given. We're taught that the best gifts are God-given. And that's true. Life and love and hope and connections to each other and the desire to help and the desire to make things better, just to name a very few. But I think maybe the most important teaching that comes down about gifts is that we are to give. Just give. Not with any sense of expectation or obligation conferred, not expecting to be repaid or even appreciated always or enough to make us feel good. Gifts aren't for that or about that, the teaching is. We give just because that's what we do. That's who we are. We gift to do that annoying thing where I verb a word. We gift because God first gifted us. And in terms of receiving, we have to let other people give us their gifts, be those generous actors, so that they can do what they do and be who they are, too. We can receive with grace, and that means not automatically going to, how am I going to repay this, gift them back? In the largest sense, in the God sense, we have been given gifts that we can never repay. We all have ways of gifting each other, whether with a thoughtful item or a listening ear or a well-timed reaching out or a beautiful performance or any and every other use of the gifts that God first gifted us. You yourself are a gift. Whenever you give to others and whenever you are just shining your light in the world.